two, and we are back. Beaufort County Media Day. Coach Gene Clemens joined by Thomas Hayward Academy offensive lineman. Um, seems like the running back and quarterback may be in good hands at Thomas Hayward Academy this year. Quillen White, Max Hickey, Preston Hamilton, fellas, thank you for joining me. I appreciate it. Um, one of the things we're going into a new season, everybody starts off zero and zero. What's something that you guys are really looking forward to this year for the season? Just going out there and playing rebel football. You know, we, we've been preparing and we're just getting ready. Okay. What about you? We looking to push guys off the ball. We're not looking for nothing easy. We coming hard every play, every snap, every game. Absolutely. Max, what do you think? Honestly, I just want people to know like who we are. Like I want us all to be able to join together as a team and work together and just become a better football team. What's what's one of the things, the best things about being offensive linemen? You know, offensive linemen, that's a it's a different world in the trenches. Mm -hmm. Um and, and you guys play offense, defensive linemen, so so you know. What's one of the things that's that's different about being an offensive lineman? I think, you know, one of the things is the bond that we've created, you know, as a group, and it just helps us work together and put people in the dirt. Absolutely. What do you think? The thing about the offensive line, it's no, it's not five people. You got to act as one because if the whole line doesn't do their job, the play can, instead of a touchdown, the play can go for a tackle for a loss or just a five-yard gain. Gotcha, gotcha. I, I agree with Preston. I mean, if we weren't a team and if we don't work as one, nothing's going to happen. And we just got to work together and drive people off the ball and put people in the dirt. What's some of the fun things about being an offensive lineman? I mean, most of the time, y'all tend to be some of the goofiest people mm -hmm. on the team. Yeah. Like, what's the what's the thing that's that's the fun part about being on the old line? Getting high and pushing people around. Yeah. Yeah, yeah absolutely. I, I agree with Quillen. Pushing people on the ground, put people in the dirt, doing your job. Um, you are you guys back in school yet? Have you started? Uh, tomorrow, no. tomorrow. So you're starting tomorrow. What's the thing you're looking forward to getting back into school? That routine, you know, the after routine. school, getting to practice. Yep. Yeah. It's very interesting. I've I've had quite a few student athletes come on. Some of them said, you know, they're not looking forward to it. Nobody wants it said, girls. Yeah. What happened to you guys? <laughs> what happened? When I first day of school for me, when I was in high school, I didn't care about anything else except for where were the girls. I don't even understand what happened to you guys. No, I'm just kidding. I'm only kidding. But it is a great thing to be back in front of people. Um, do you always feel like there's an extra because you're known, people know who you are, even without the jersey, like people know if you're a football player. Um, do you feel like there's like an extra pressure with that? Yeah, three years in a row, we got that target on our back. So everybody's looking out for this rough. And and where would you say, Max? Um, where where would you say that you're hoping to end the season at this year? I want to win another one. I mean, it's my senior year. I want to win another one for all my boys. And go out on go top. Out on top. Yeah. Absolutely, absolutely. Um, what do you think is going to be the biggest, um, the biggest obstacle that you're going to have to overcome if you want to win it again? Staying mental. Have that mental, that mental, um, just being mental. Staying focused, Staying making focused sure. Because you can't be focused physically if you ain't focused mentally. You got to push yourself to be the best. Absolutely, absolutely. Um, Preston, Max, Quillen, um, thank you for joining me. Anybody want to drop a social for people that, you know, coaches that might want to, you know, check you out, see what you've got? Anybody is sitting on some offers that you want some other people to know about? Hey, y'all need to come get me too. Q851 on Twitter. Was that Q White 51? Q White 51. That's Quillen White. Q White 51. Make sure that you follow him. M underscore Hickey 17 on Twitter. Um, Max Hickey M underscore 17. 17. And Preston Hamilton, but without the O. Preston Hamilton without the O. <laughs> Is that without the O in Preston or without the O in Hamilton? Oh, without the o in Hamilton. Got you. Preston Hamilton without the O in Hamilton. All on Twitter. This is the offensive line for Thomas Hayward Academy. Y'all better watch out. Y'all in trouble. These boys are coming for on um, blood. I appreciate you fellas for joining me. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We're going to get a few more of your own of your of your teammates in here. So y'all, when y'all slide out, they're going to slide on in. Come on in, fellas.
Without the O. Just in case you were wondering, find them without the O. You gotta you gotta put the you gotta put the short guy in the front so that there's no problem. Um, I'm joined with some other um, some other young men. Um, give them your name, sir. Dietrich Schufer. Dietrich Schufer, number twenty three, and this is a quarterback, right? Yes, sir. Dietrich, I, I'm just gonna say right now the one thing that I like about um, you, you don't really seem to be phased by a whole lot. Like you're just you're just kind of going with the flow, right? Yes, sir. Do you think that's something that that gives you an advantage as a quarterback, being able to stay poised? Well, as a quarterback, you need to learn to be able to control what you can't control. So don't get worried about things that aren't your fault. Mm -hmm. Just play your game and lead your team to do what's best. And if you can't control it, then don't stress over it. Absolutely, absolutely. And um, back here, give us your name. Um, Brandon Harlow. I play uh, middle linebacker. And I play slide tight end. Now you're wearing number one. So anytime you're wearing number one, there's obviously, you know, somebody's expecting something of you. Um, there's an example that's set when you're wearing number one. Yes, sir. Well, I got I got my own goals, so I just play at my pace and I do what I do with my team. Absolutely. What are you? What are the things that you do that you think um, makes you unique? Um, I'm, I'm gonna give it. I'm gonna give it my all every day. I practice games. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just. 100% absolutely, absolutely. Go right ahead. Tell us who. I'm Cody Parker. Cody Parker. Yes, sir. Yeah, I'm Cody Parker. <laughs> Parker, what do you play? I play safety and wide receiver. Safety and wide receiver. So, does he throw you enough passes? Sometimes. He, sometimes. <laughs> How many times have you been wide open and he not throw you the ball? Just, just keep it a buck. It's all right. I'll say two. Two times where you were just like, yo. So when you so when you go back to the huddle, so this is the one I'm a receiver, you know what I'm saying? I play receiver and tight end. When you're when you're wide open and you go back to the huddle, you know you can't just be like, yo, what? You gotta you gotta massage it, right? Yeah. But in your mind, what are you thinking <laughs> when you're that wide open? Do you just go, dude? <laughs> I just I just kind of stand there for a minute. Look around the field, make sure I don't make a fool of myself. Absolutely. Before I, before I try to keep, tell them about it. Usually wait until y'all come off the field and you're sitting out. Hey, man. And you know what the great, the, the worst part for the quarterback, but the best part for us is we actually have video proof now. Yeah. Like, hey, we go back to this huddle sideline. I'm going to show, look, look, I'm wide open right here. You need to, I, I think it's a great thing. So um, we know you want to win it again, obviously. Yeah. You know, I mean, you just held your hand. I held, Hold it up again just in case people weren't paying no attention. I mean, this is what they're doing around here. So I know we know you want to win it again. What's the one thing that you believe you're going to have to do if you want to be standing on top at the end of the season? I mean, we got to find that brotherhood again. We got to come close, and then we just got to trust each other. That's all it is. Absolutely. Anybody else want to add anything to that? Execute. Execute? You're back in school tomorrow. Yes, sir. You're back in school tomorrow. We've we've already established that apparently nobody likes girls anymore. Like no, er, everybody's just about football. That was the big. Everybody's just about football. Nobody wants to to see what 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 it's looking like over there anymore. But that's just the bigs. That's not y'all. Okay, just wanted to make sure I wasn't alone in these <laughs> these types of things when I was in school. Um, but no, beyond that. Is it, is it really cool just to be back in school and, and, and see and know everybody is hyped up about this yeah, football yeah, season? Love, yeah, love in there for the back. Yeah. Absolutely, absolutely. Well, I, I wish you guys nothing but the best. Um, we look forward to seeing you on top at the end of the season. Um, here's hoping for health and, and making sure that y'all guys keep the main thing the main thing. You want to drop any socials right now? Well, you can have me on Twitter at um, The Real Butter. At The Real Butter? B-U-D-D-A. The Real Butter, B-U-D-D-A. D-Money, 12 underscore 23 on Instagram. Dietrich Schufert on Twitter. See, he kept it He kept it professional for Twitter, but then he gave you the ratchet stuff for, the, <laughs> for Instagram. I like it. I like it. I got Twitter and Instagram, Parker 92244. Parker 92244, ladies and gentlemen. You know, 
the the receiving battery. You've got the man, the myth, the legend wearing the number one at linebacker, Thomas Hayward Academy. Fellas, thank you for joining me. Yes, sir. All right. Um, that was Thomas Hayward Academy. Stay tuned. We've got more teams coming up. Buford County Media Day. I'm Coach Gene Clemens. Y'all stay tuned.